good morning let us discuss today symmetry elements in crystal systems or symmetry in crystals what are the symmetry elements present in crystal systems what are the elements of symmetry present in crystal systems there are three symmetry operations or three symmetry present in crystal systems they are planes of symmetry axis of symmetry center of symmetry in plane of in plane of symmetry there are three rectangular plane of symmetry and six diagonal plane of symmetry we will see further what is called plane of symmetry in crystal system there are two types of plane of symmetry and in crystal system they are rectangular plane of symmetry and the diagonal plane of symmetry now we will see what is plane of symmetry define plane of symmetry in crystal system it is an imaginary plane see the green shade it is an imaginary plane that divides the crystal into two equal halves the two equal halves are related to object and the mirror images one is object another is mirror image so it is an imaginary plane or mirror that divides the cubic crystal or crystal into two equal halves okay there are two types of plane of symmetry we will see further in cubic crystal system there are two planes of symmetry present in it one rectangular plane of symmetry two diagonal plane of symmetry i have shown the rectangular and the diagonal planes of symmetry in cubic system there are three rectangular plane of symmetry i have shown here only two they are mutually perpendicular to each other similar to x axis y axis and z axis let us consider the plane mirror plane brown color or green color rectangular the rectangular plane of symmetry is passing through four edge centers see this is edge there are uh, 12 edges four 1 2 3 4 4 8 9 10 11 12 there are four the rectangular plane of symmetry is passing by a four edge centers 1 2 3 4 therefore there are 12 edge centers divided by one plane passing through four there are three rectangular planes of symmetry the diagonal plane of symmetry is passing through the two edges two edges of the cube okay this is a cube and one edge this is another edge so yep yeah, the rectangular plane of symmetry is passing through two edges Therefore, there are 12 edges, we have seen just now, divided by 12 edges, therefore 12 edge centers divided by 2. Okay, here 4, because 4 it is. There are 6 diagonal planes of symmetry present in cubic crystal system. Let us see now, what is called axis of symmetry or axis of symmetry. There are 4 types of axis of symmetry present in crystal systems in general two fold or diode axis of symmetry three fold uh, c2 axis of symmetry c3 axis of symmetry three fold or triad axis of symmetry c4 four fold tetrad axis of symmetry six fold axis of symmetry axis of symmetry is present in hexagonal crystal systems these three are present in cubic crystal system this is present in cubic crystal system, uh, hexagonal crystal system. Let us define what is an axis of symmetry. It is an imaginary line. You see, this is C4 axis of symmetry, C3 axis of symmetry is passing through this, C2 axis of symmetry. It is an imaginary line passing through the crystal. It is when rotated by 360 degree or 
that is one complete revolution it gives the same or similar appearances more than once okay for example c4 axis of symmetry or tetrad axis of symmetry if the crystal is rotated by 360 degree or on complete one revolution the same appearance is repeated four times same appearance is repeated four times then the axis of symmetry is called triad tetrad axis of symmetry in the case of c2 axis of symmetry on, com on complete one revolution the same appearance it presents the same appearance twice it presents the similar appearance twice then it is called diode axis of symmetry or p2 axis of symmetry in cubic crystal system there are three axis of symmetry present they are four fold axis of symmetry three fold axis of symmetry and two fold axis of symmetry the c4 axis of symmetry the tetrad axis of symmetry is passing through the two phase centers see this is uh, there are six phases uh, we have seen earlier there are six phases therefore there are six phase centers each c4 axis of symmetry is passing through two phase centers opposite phase centers opposite phase centers of cubic crystal okay therefore you have six phase centers divided by three we have already seen the two therefore there are three c4 axis of symmetry c3 is passing c3 is passing to the diagonally opposite corner atoms diagonally opposite corner atoms there are eight corner atoms you see 1 2 3 4 there are eight corners in a cube therefore eight divided by 2 4 C3 axis of symmetry. There are we can draw this way. This then this that you can draw four C3 axis of symmetry in crystal cubic crystal. And C2 axis. See this is edge center. C2 axis is passing through the diagonally opposite edge center. Two just are diagonally opposite edge centers. Therefore there are twelve edge centers 12 by 2 each c2 axis is passing through two edge center therefore 12 by 2 there are six c2 axis present in cubic crystal i have shown here the c4 c3 c2 axis of symmetry how many numbers are present in cubic crystal in the center there is a center of symmetry present in cubic crystal okay the center of symmetry is also present in cubic crystal only one center of symmetry is present in cubic crystal what is called center of symmetry in crystal system it is an imaginary point in axis of symmetry it is an imaginary line whereas here it is an imaginary point at the center of the crystal present in the crystal that any line passing through it for example any line passing through it intersects the surface of the crystal at equal distances see at equal distances similar atoms are present at equal distances similar atoms are present on either side this side or this side or here okay so it is an image what is called center of symmetry it is present in cubic crystal system only one is present it is an imaginary point in the crystal that any line passing through it intersects meets with the meets the surface of the crystal at equal distances the same atom on either side on either so in cubic crystal system there are nine planes of symmetry we have seen earlier 
13 axis of symmetry and one center of symmetry. Therefore, there are 23 elements of symmetry present in cubic crystal. What is called element of symmetry? Elements of symmetry. The total number of symmetry operations present in cubic crystal is called elements of symmetry. Therefore, there are 23 elements of symmetry present in cubic crystal. In this slide, I have summarized the 23 elements of symmetry present in cubic crystals. Thank you for watching.